Eastern Arctic. Well, Mr. Speaker, when I travel through the Northwest Territories to the different communities, those that have settled claims have relationships at the community level, at the regional level, with all people. They're working with all people. That's how you get things done in Canada. But you, take, you get things done in Canada from a position of having something to offer. When First Nations have settled claims, when they, un, they have the certainty on their land, they have something really tangible to offer. They can control that offer as well. They can make that offer. They can tailor that offer in a way that works for them. That's, that's progress. That's going to make progress. That's what all Canadians want. Mr. Speaker, I'm a landowner. I, I control the land that I, I have. I make decisions about it. I, I invest if I have to. I look for partners if I have to. These are things that we do as Canadians. I want First Nations to have all those abilities that we all have as Canadians tied to what they have from their ancestors, what they have from their position on this land. Thirty times the courts have agreed with Aboriginal people on land issues. Thirty times in a row. When are we going to wake up? When are we going to quit being so idle on these issues?